Um, so I've arrived at Tabacon Thermal Springs. It's basically a natural river that flows from a volcano. Um, and because of volcanic activity in the area, the water is like naturally hot. So this is like the public one, which I'm not going to be going in. It's literally on the side of the road in the jungle. So it's open to anyone. You can just go in and swim in the river. I've just come to have a look because I've gotten here really early. But I've booked myself a day pass, well, a morning pass at the Tabacon Resort and Spa, which is like a really fancy spa in the area. I think it's the best one in La Fortuna, r, &R area. And um, I know a few people that have been and they said it, it's beautiful, it's really nice and it's worth a visit. So I was hoping to get here really early and get some pictures. Um, the security guard won't let me in. So I'm just here for a wander to have a look around what's down here. It's basically just a really long like highway. It's quite busy with like forest jungle on either side and then there's this river. There are a few people in there at the moment. I'm not gonna go in this one. I'm just gonna hang around and wait so I can get into the resort um, and hopefully get some good, good shots um, of the volcano from there. Yeah, I just stopped, I just stopped filming because a snake just went past me. I nearly stepped on it. Oh my God, it's gone there. It's gone under a rock. But I'm really liking Arenal and La Fortuna. I think it's my best favorite place so far. So we went to the r, &R and La Fortuna waterfall for a couple of hours on the day we arrived. And then yesterday I booked myself onto canyoning, which was wicked, I had such a good time. I've always wanted to try canyoning, so Costa Rica was the perfect place to do that. We're going to Sarapiki Rainforest tomorrow, which will also be really nice. I think we're staying in like a really remote lodge. Um, and you, you get there like tractor and boat and stuff like that, so that'll be an adventure. Um, yeah, so once I get in, I'll, I'll take some more shots and photos and stuff. So my friends, first of all, good afternoon to all of you. So my name is Carlos, or Charlie, as you prefer to call me, my friends call me Charlie. I'm going to be your local tour guide for tonight and tomorrow. just arrived in the Sarapiki rainforest um, oh my gosh there's so many insects here it's crazy um, yeah we're in the Sarapiki rainforest at the Pozo Azul jungle lodge um, it's all outside and like tented accommodation um, we've got the afternoon free so we're just playing cards and things like that and then we've got dinner in the evening and then a night walk in the jungle um, there's a lot of insects and creepy crawlies here I've already been bitten by soldier ants <laughs> Um, because they were a bit unhappy about me dragging my luggage 
spots where they're walking. Um, so there's a lot, I've just dealt myself in bug repellent, but I don't think it's doing anything. Um, it's really rustic, it's all outdoors. And yeah, you can hear all the wildlife and stuff, so it's really nice. Um, it's really pretty. This is probably the most exciting accommodation we've been to so far. Aside from the insects, it's really good. Um, it's quite nice to be disconnected as well. There's no signal or Wi-Fi or anything here. Um, but yeah, so we're just chilling in the communal di dining area at the moment, um, playing cards, card games and things like that, which is quite nice. And then we've got dinner at seven and then a night walk at eight, I think. And then tomorrow morning we've got 6 a.m. Um, bird watching. The lights better here. 6 a.m. bird watching, and then we've got white water rafting. Then we've got an empanada cooking demonstration session thing, and then I think we've got the afternoon off again, so we can go on like some nature trails and walks and things like that. Um, so we've got a pretty jam-packed day tomorrow, but I'm looking forward to it. It's nice actually to be in the jungle and just surrounded by all the weird and wonderful wildlife. Um, but yeah, it's starting to get dark now, so I think it'll be like pitch black once the sun sets. So I'm gonna have to crack out the headlamp and torches, but it's all an adventure and it's fun. I feel like this is how horror movies start. <laughs> Usually, it's not a big group of people. <laughs> yeah. That doesn't make. Hey, Jenny, she's never been bit by the ants that bit you three times. <laughs> the same one. <laughs> Very wild. Wild cat. Wild orange cat. Wild orange cat. This is a very wild cat right here. Brave or dumb. This is a jaguar of the night. I'm surprised your cat's still alive out here. Jaguar. Yeah. There she goes. Well, this is a juvenile bullfrog. Oh, it's lady tailed frog on female. Wow. Good spot. Is it? Oh, oh no. We Are they as aggressive the as the army ants? No, this is worse. This is worse, yeah. yeah. This is and worse. It feels like you've been No, but are they as aggressive? So, basically, the pain after this kind of an um, end bite you will be on your system for around 24 hours. Oh my god. Someone said that we don't have any antidotes of it. Nope. It's Someone... just handle the pain and that's it. Oh my god. It hurts so bad, huh? Yep. How does it compare with giving birth? So some people get uh, sick about fever and mm. headache. Mm. Just from the bite. On mm -hmm. um, one bite? Yeah. Yes. It it's really feet, painful. Like our shit. Oh, okay. So the bullet ends. Oh, oh, here's another one. Oh, my gato. <laughs> so watch your steps, my friend, what I said. So the bullet ends came from here. Oh, Are you not scared? This okay. cat? This you have a cat? What is going on? <laughs> so nobody's paying attention. <laughs> I know. He doesn't get bit by bullet ants. <laughs> look, look at the bullet ants in the tree. Oh my god. I feel like it's on me. That's Whoa. why we leaf cutter ants. Yeah, be careful, yeah. the ants are over here, my friends. Oh, my here. <laughs> <laughs> so just okay. Here. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I just purely. Okay. So move a little bit, my friends. We have an army ants there. The tree comes here. <laughs> <laughs> where is it? 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 Oh, fuck, there's no Guys, can we keep moving? <laughs> no, neither do I. Now you have that much more respect for those natural geographic. Yeah, why are they keep moving? Do you have her? I don't know, I still want to fit in. They read fucking more. A bit in order just to oh, a snake! Oh yeah. fuck! Where? 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 Oh, it's too, yeah, along the, the spine here. of that <laughs> 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 so, 
I'm not going to lick it right now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know whether to lick at the floor or to lick at the sink. <laughs> 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 Wait, no, 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 what are you doing? Oh wow, can somebody point their light out from this angle? Oh, they're bloody everywhere. Yeah, do you see the net? You step on the area. I'm going to front the line because everyone else doesn't care about me. Everyone's freaking out. No, I didn't. You walk right past it then. Amiga de... o sea, arriba. A ver, amiga de mis ansias. Para ahí encima. I didn't see the snake from the attic. No, no. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. It's like an ant. It's like a... It's like a river of ants. Hey, we have a spider, a snake, growth. Please settle in now. It was a pleasure to be your tour guide in this night walk. So for tomorrow, my friends, remember, bear watching will be starting at 6 a.m. Right here.